Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button right there. If you hear from my last video, my Instagram, my TikTok, you know, somewhere else and you watched the first video and you already liked and you subscribed and you commented, all that good stuff, welcome back and I appreciate you 100%. dresser i gotta take my nieces shopping i gotta go grocery shopping i gotta do my laundry you know i got a couple things i gotta do so i'm gonna just vlog and, um... don't you hate when like it's, it's like some itching like right on the corner or like on the other side like that joint be really hitting like it feels so good when you're getting it out I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I'm talking about with the tote situation. I know y'all gonna comment and stuff about my TV and my dresser and my blow up bed, but I don't care. You feel me? I love myself. I love my situation. I'm grateful that I have a roof over my head. You know, I'm grateful that I do have clothes. I'm grateful that I do have a TV. You know, I'm grateful for things like that. So, like, I've always been the same since growing up in Camden. We don't come from the best situations. Now that I'm older, I see things different. I see stuff from the perspective that my father saw things from. So. I'm able to accept things and, and be okay with it more. But it's, it's not the same with them. Like, with them, like, um, I make sure they got everything. Like, they rum is, they got everything in their room. I think it's just more so with me. I don't, I'm grateful for the situation that I'm in and the things that I do have. And I don't think I have to, I don't feel like, I don't feel the need to go, go out and go shopping and get all this. Even though I can go buy a bed right now, I can go buy a dresser. But I am going to go buy a dresser because I, I, I'm tired of just, being unorganized, but I can go buy those things. I can go buy a 75 inch TV, a big TV and all this. I can go do that, but do I want to? Do I need to? No, I'm grateful and I'm okay with my situation. This is what I'm talking about, y'all. You see I, all my clothes, like when I do laundry, I, um, I literally fold all my clothes up and put them in here. You know, my TV sit on here, I got a little, oh shit. I got a little TV that sit on here that I barely watch it, but um, basically that's the dirty clothes bin right there. So you see it's full already. I still got clothes in here, but I don't know. It's like every time I want to get dressed, I got to lift this up. Now I've been thugging it out for a while, but I'm about to go get me a dresser today. Get out of this tote situation. Dirty clothes. I might as well give y'all a little room tour. This is my nice little blow up bed right here. I love my blow up bed. My baby's jumper, you know, I gotta have that. Then they little kitchen set. My son broke his, broke it. I gotta get the screws and put it back together, but they do got a little kitchen. And I gotta order them some more food because they, um, for some reason they lost all of it. And I don't know. Um, this is their toy chest. You know, they got all toys. This thing full with toys, but I gotta get them some more, but, um, Yeah, it's all my shoes, you know, my baby bed, you know, I got to have that right next to me. And this is the one, this is the one where you can, uh, you can like pull this up in case your baby is like, in case he, uh, your baby likes to like crawl out of things and stuff. You can lock him in there. Like my son, he just turned eight months and. He, he climbs off, but I like to have it to where I can just grab my baby, like, you know. I like it down here, right here. Get right on my bed. If I'm sleeping here, he sleep right there. If I need anything, I reach over and grab him. Um, and this is just a balloon that's just been in my room for a while. I don't even know where it came from, but I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna remove it because it's just moving around. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's my room. 
And this is my father right here. This is the this is the man, the reason behind everything. I'm gonna make a video dedicated directly to this man right here. This is my father, this is my everything. I wake up every day to this, to my father, right here. All phases of his life is right here. This is this is a special man, and you know, he, he means so much to me. And every day I get off of this bed and I roll over and I look up, I see this smile, and I look around, and I just become so grateful because this man is the reason for my everything. You know, the reason why many people was blessed and the reason why, um, you know, I'm just the way I am today with life and just handling business and, you know, taking care of my kids, taking care of my family. Like, it all goes back to him. So um, this backdrop will be in my room for a long, long time. It ain't going nowhere. Um, but I am making a section in the house for him, but yep, this is my room. And I would like you to get the f out of here. Oh, get out of here. Get out of my room. Get out of my This is the store we chose, Bob's Furniture. Let's see what they got in there. Just need a simple black dresser, nothing too crazy. And I ain't, I'm definitely not trying to spend no band or no you feel me? These prices looking crazy. I like that. For 500, that's not bad. This ain't bad at all. This ain't bad. What's that? Okay. Got three. I can work with that, so. It's all right. I like this. Well, I definitely want like a black dresser though because the bed that I want, I want a black frame. So once I do decide to go get a bed and stuff, it's going to be black. So um, I want the dresser, whatever one I get, I want it to be black. So that one I just saw, that was good. I like that one. It was a good price and it came with a mirror. So um, it's looking like that's my top option right now because I'm not seeing nothing else. I'm just seeing beds and stuff. So. Found something else that's a good little price. You feel me? As long as it's in this range, that's fine. That, that's cool. But yeah, this is fine though. I like this. I like that. Because it's like space. I could put more clothes in here. Like the other one was cool. Like the look was cool and everything. But I low-key got a lot of clothes. So I really don't want to... Um, I want something that got space in it. You know what I'm saying? This is a nice, nice looking um, thing. I don't know if it come with the mirror, but if it do, that's a plus. But for just this, that's fine. I like that. I do like that. I found this one. This is nice, but the only thing about it is the color. But at the end of the day, um, I know how to paint and stuff. I can literally strip this off, get this off of here, and paint this like whatever color I want. So now that I think about it, the color really wouldn't matter. Like this is a lot of space for my clothes you know that's all i'm really worrying about is just so i can have enough space and um i like this one this one is actually cool so uh, this is my third option so i got one over there so i don't think i don't think i'll get this one because it's only three dresser it's only three drawers in this one it's only three you know um Oh yeah, and they, and they short, they like the short jumps, so. I don't know, this is more so, this Oh nah, this is out of the picture. I don't want this one no more. It's nice, but nah, I'm cool off of that. 
So I'm back in the car. Um, I just left. I ain't doing that. I need to go somewhere to where um, I can get, I can walk out with my stuff. Like they talking about it takes three to five days, which I should have already knew that. But um, I think I just want to go to like Ikea or something. Or if I order it on Amazon, I can get it like the next day or something like that. I don't know, but I got to go um, take them shopping. So I'm about to just leave that for another day. But yeah, I'm about to go pick up my nieces and then I'm going to take them shopping. A few moments later. Hi guys, my name is Josiah. You're probably like, who is Josiah? Well, I'm Jimmy's niece, and I'm 12 years old. And I'm in sixth grade. We just have been shopping, y'all. Yeah. So he's about to, he's peeing for his stuff right now. And I'm just sitting here chilling. Like, Farmer Mills is the best. Like, they got, they got place that you can get. They got pictures and they got all posters. But yeah, he's probably going to block this off, but he's about to nails. We're gonna be doing a lot of stuff on this channel. I'm sorry, but we're gonna do a lot of stuff on this channel. And people, it's like we're new, so it's gonna be a nice and difficult time. So, we're just gonna find out. Josiah Williams signing off.
Bye, guys. All right, so we back in the car. I just did the shopping. We went to Farmer Mills and Dick's and got them some stuff. So now it's time to head to my favorite store and get some fruit. Her stomach is hurt, and so she keep crying to go home. And she's still sitting in my baby's car seat, not listening. But we about to head over to Mom's Organic Market. This is the best grocery store that you ever going to walk into. Everything in there is organic and healthy. It's good for you. We all love it. Especially the grapes. I like we the love grapes. the grapes. I, and like, no, no, my favorite is actually the blueberries. You have been warned. Oh, my niece. So she really had a tummy ache and... And she... I told you I had to throw up. And she okay. really just puked all in my car. Look at my seat. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the? Yeah, you can you can get her out. Get her out. My car. He really just sat here and threw up all that in my car, yo. So now we're not going to, I gotta go home and get this smell out of my car and scrub my car up. I'm gonna go lay in there, babe. Wipe your face. What? I told you, I just said and that I told like I had to go Yeah, you did say you had to throw up, but. but I told her, I told me. I told and I tried me. to, I was like, this shit, hold it in. No, said, you don't ever try to hold it in and no. throw up. I don't care, I can clean this car, I can no, get no, it matter, replaced. No, yes, I said, Nuni, you keep, because Nuni said I'm not sick. I said, yes, I am. And if, I said, you keep playing. She kept saying, you're not sick, girl, I'm not gonna get sick. I said, Nuni. I'm, I, I kept trying to hide my face because I did not want to get sick because it really don't How about we play the quiet game? Yeah, starting now. So now I got it. Well, half I do the car. Where's the Where's the thing that you have on your car to sit? Is you good though? Now my stomach don't hurt no more. I'm not hurting she just threw up her whole, like everything she had on her stomach is crazy. She just threw up y'all. Cause it really smelled bad in this car. Like, oh my God. And I've been in this car with that smell for about five or six minutes and it's kicking. So when we get home, we're gonna have a haul of everything that we bought, but we're not gonna try it on because no one, that's just, no one wants to try on all clothes to take all of the clothes off. My sister might try them on. See, her like her size is actually big. It's big enough because if they not, then he could return them. But I already know all my clothes can fit me. I want to see my shoes again. My shoes are so nice. And I want to see my uncle's slice that he got. Look, this is my uncle's favorite. Ugh. Rainbow water. This is how it looks. He loves coconut water. This is the off-brand one, but he never get this kind. CO2. Wait, remember, is this from our organic store? Yeah. Oh well, this is your new one, fit, new flavor. Yeah, but I don't like it. Well, there's your answer. All coconut flavors do not taste the same, cause he do not like this one. You got ingredients. I don't like coconut water that got ingredients. But let me see. The, the more ingredients, the the worse it tastes, or the bad for you. This got ingredients. It got that much ingredients. If y'all cannot, I'm sorry, the car is kind of moving, but if y'all cannot tell, I'm gonna try to back it up. Son. If y'all cannot tell, it got it got the ingredients. If you can't see it, I don't know, because I can definitely see it. Can you see that? Like, you see the ingredients? I'm going to read it for you. It says, organic coconut water, less than 1% organic can, sh can sugar. Based on total volume per serving, electrolytes, whatever y'all want to call that source. Sodium, calcium, cal calcium, what is it called? Man, man. Calcium. What? Ingredients. Calcium. Oh, I forgot. You can make two C sounds. Calcium and potassium. <gasps> potassium. This is my uncle's about when he says he's bad for us. Because if you think, of, if you look at these, this is that. A lot of ingredients. Bad. That's probably why my sister's done up because we was drinking junk and we was eating stuff like this. 
my uncle told me. Filtered water? Oh, filtered water. Hi, is corn syrup in here? It's pear juice. It's kiwi juice. Concentrate. Huh? Concentrate. Which me? Is that what it say afterwards? Kiwi yeah. juice concentrate? Yeah, con, no. Concert. Concentrate. Con yeah. Concent. Oh. <laughs> Kiwi juice from concentrate. C or G. Gum. Easter. They put gum in this? Everything is poison. Easter Everything. gum. <laughs> yes, me. You just want to see your camera? Feeling better? I heard y'all. She said she feeling better. But I don't think that she feeling better because that's just nasty. The fact I'm not even mad. It's just the way that it's like I was just trying to eat my chips in peace. <laughs> that's you know how I said I got this one out the window. I bit that chip and see I heard you. I took, I, I spit that chip right out and I threw it in, and I threw it out the window. I did not eat it no more. That blew me. That's the only thing that really blew me because I was trying to eat my chips peacefully and drink my juice, but now I can't even eat nothing or drink nothing to this milk that my my nose. Yesterday, y'all, I was sick. After I got my nails done, which was when Tuesday, I got sick, and then I I got sick Wednesday. Wait. Huh? So remember, Jake, I was sick when I went to go get my, the day I got my nails in? Yeah, I went to go get my nails on Tuesday. I got sick Wednesday. And today, that's me's going, my, that's me's sick, but she's going to stop on Friday. So that means somebody else in this house, except my uncle, because he's healthy. And the, the bugs won't come to him because they are eating, you know, that his, they, they want not, they don't want good stuff. So they only want to come to people that have, that eat his junk. So my uncle is going to be the only one in this house that didn't get sick because he know how to, he know how to clear his body and make him healthy and stuff. Which is we need to start doing, but I'm telling you right now, the way that we're eating right now is not gonna help. It's not we're not gonna start doing that. But like this is disgusting. One hour later. So I don't got that much laundry. It was just one little bin. So I'm about to knock this out real quick. Um, I brought my skates. So while this is in the washer and drying, I'll be practicing with those. Um, but yeah. this key for about a week and I found it in one of my pants and we found some money seven dollars so this is why you always check the pockets I didn't have to really separate it, so it's all going in one, which is a win for me, for my coins. And I don't know if y'all do this too, like I'm extra, like what I do is, I put like three caps in, like inside there and in the thing, so.
just to make sure. Do anybody else do that? Do y'all put the, um, the soap directly inside and like a cap on top or I'm just the only one that do that? This is why I like to do laundry at night. Like, it'd be nobody in here. Like, look. The laundromat is like a place of peace for me, for real. Like, I sit here, I fold all my clothes. Like, I just relax. Now I got my skates. So I'm about to actually put these on. It's 23 minutes left, so I'm about to just skate for 23 minutes until that, um, until the clothes are ready. And y'all about to just watch me skate. Gotta sit down for a little bit, man. Skating, that's a workout. Whew. But I love skating. I will forever keep my skates in my car. If I'm anywhere, I'm gonna pull my skates out every time. And I'm gonna skate. I'm gonna skate every single time. It just don't matter where I'm at, what I'm doing. If I got free time, and it's a floor that looks like this, and it's smooth, best believe my skates is coming out. If you're not a skater, you just don't understand it until you start skating. Like I just, I used to skate like when I was um, younger, but like I just learned how to skate backwards and do moves and stuff. So like now it's different. Like I want to skate every single day. It's the same with bowling. Like once I learn how to bowl, I want to bowl every single day. I keep my bowling balls in my car too. So, but somebody did come and steal my skates out of my car at one time. But I knew who it was and I couldn't do nothing about it, but I'm just always prepared to have fun, you know? Skating is a fun thing to do. It's an exercise and it's just fun. You know, you hear the music, you just skate to the music. When you bowl, well, when I bowl, I can speak, I'm only speaking for myself. Um, when I bowl, it's like the same thing, it's peaceful. I, I like to bowl solo. Sometimes I bowl with a friend. I just can't bowl with everybody, so there's certain people that I can bowl with. But once I do go and bowl, and I usually go by myself most of the time, so. Seven minutes left. camera died, well my camera didn't die, 
It ran out of storage, as you can see there. And I'm gonna vlog a full day with me and my children. I'm gonna take them out and stuff like that. Um, Cause I, I've been getting them, but I just didn't feel comfortable like going to the camera. And then plus, I don't think when I have my kids, I don't think about the camera. I don't even want to pick the camera up. So, but next week when I do get my children, I'm, I'm definitely going to do a vlog. Um, yeah, so just stay tuned and I appreciate y'all and I'll see y'all on the next vlog.